Hello you guys, welcome back to Legend Talk. Hey Jordan, what? give me a favor. Talk your shit gang. Alright, bet. Alright guys, welcome back to Legend Talk. It's been a while, I've been off of YouTube for a couple of days. Trying to get my shit together and I'm always busy and tired all, all the time and stuff like that. But the first thing we're going to get into is the whole entire Aaron Rodgers situation. So, I'm a Chicago Bears fan. And Aaron Rodgers saying that he does not want to return back to the Green Bay Packers gives me great joy in life. It, it makes me fill with energy and happiness and praise like i'm absolutely happy because of that and the thing about this is i'm tired of all these stupid ass packers fans coming to my job wearing packers gear and thinking that aaron Rodgers is going to come back offer him free food and saying that espn is lying and espn is fake no it's not that at all it's just aaron Rodgers don't want to come back to your stupid ass team that's the reason why that's the reason why. And if, if Aaron Rodgers is gone, the division is ours for the taking. It's just like blows my mind by all these Packers fans. Just because Aaron Rodgers hasn't commented anything doesn't mean he wants to st stay with the Packers or the, the story isn't true. You think Anthony Davis said anything when he asked for a trade? No. If he, if he did, don't call me on that. But, like I'm saying, bro, if he doesn't want to come back to you, just let it go. You selected a quarterback in the first round last year and traded up for the guy. If, if that was me, and I'm, a, and I'm the best player on the team and one of the best quarterbacks in the NFL, I'll be pissed. That That's a part of it. And then a stupid-ass play call in the NFC Championship game cost him. Cost him. Yeah, Aaron Rodgers couldn't. Could have uh, won by uh, running in. Yeah, but I could have had another chance at it if Matt LaFleur didn't make... Man, it just really blows my mind. If he made better play calls, Aaron Rodgers wouldn't ask for that trade or ask to uh, not uh, be with the Packers anymore. He's going he's gonna to get traded sooner or whatever. Or they're going to pull Deshaun Watson and say, oh, he was sexually assaulting me or something like that. Uh, if Aaron, if uh, Deshaun Watson did that, I apologize to the people on my channel and so, so on. But I doubt it, bro. And the thing is, like, I, I, don't, I just don't believe it. Like, I just don't believe it. Like, Aaron Rodgers is going to be gone from the Packers. You guys got to believe that. If you guys don't believe that, you're a chump. You're a freaking chump. He is gone, and he never, ever, 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 ever coming back. Just deal with it. Shut up and trade the man. You don't give him no respect. Why Why should he give you respect by staying there? And I... Man. It feels so great to finally have a chance to win this division again. Ah, oh, man. I'm tired of those stupid-ass Packers fans. Bear down, bitch. All right, another uh, situation going on is a Floyd Mayweather and Logan Paul fight, you know. Um, I, I don't like, sometimes, like, I don't like when people talk shit. You got to put your money where your mouth is. And uh, do I think Logan Paul got a chance to get Floyd Mayweather? Hell no. But he's bigger in size, and that gets him some type of advantage. He's going to be watching... Uh, what is it? Uh, shit, Rock is it Rocky three, with uh when uh when uh, wait wait yeah it's Rocky it was Rocky three when Creed got his ass whooped by Drago. It, 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 he's gonna he, he's gonna keep on watching that fight. He's gonna he gonna, he's gonna watch that fight. He's gonna watch it. Would it be big? It'll blow up that fucking internet if Logan Paul. Defeats Floyd Mayweather. It'll blow the fucking internet. Do I think he has a chance? Hell no. But I like how like he's putting off his influence on YouTube and social media to make this fight bigger than what it is. And I and I fuck with that. And I appreciate Logan Paul doing that because 
now it gives YouTubers like me, like, okay, when I get my subscribers and my likes and my influence up, I can do anything I want on the side and make a hell of a lot of money. And he's, uh, he's one of the main reasons why I got into YouTube because him doing YouTube and then him doing all these talk, these talk shows with the podcast and boxing and I think he has a clothing line too, you know. You know, I appreciate the Paul Brothers for like using YouTube and making it for like you to actually get an advantage of doing something in life. I appreciate that. But that fight, I don't think Jake Jakey, I understand. Okay, that's your brother, but this is Logan's fight. I'll appreciate it. I'll I'll go it'll, it'll make sense if Logan and Floyd got in that type of fight, but it didn't. It was Jake, you know. Floyd says he's going to be both of their asses. He probably will. Because Floyd, he's undefeated. He fought legit boxers. But I, what I really don't like is these, these promoters, like Stephen A. said this morning, these promoters are putting up to this fight, but they ain't going to give us the Errol Spence versus Terrence Crawford match that I actually put my money where my mouth is. I actually bet money on that fight. I bet money on the Terrence Crawford versus Errol Spence fight. C Crawford on the way, but... I don't think that fight gonna happen, but it's pretty dis disrespectful what Jake Paul did. Floyd, if you push Floyd to the limit, he's gonna knock your ass out at the end of the day. So hopefully this fight will be decent. I don't know if I'm gonna watch it, but I'm gonna hear about it and I'm gonna react to it. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Alright, the last thing we're gonna talk about today is uh Caitlyn Jenner running for governor of California. And a lot of people don't like transgenders and think transgenders should stay out of politics and I I feel kinda of differently about this. You are who you are, man. If you want if you wanna go and be a transgender, be gay or something like that, that's your choice. When you get to uh adult age you can make that choice. I just don't I don't know. I ain't putting my religion in there. But you know, if he if she or he I'm gonna say he, I'm gonna say he, I'm gonna say he if he believes that he has a chance about doing this and stuff like that and has a authority and ha has no knows a lot about politics and so on, you know. He Caitlyn Jenner honestly believes that transgenders like don't need to be in like suppose if like I'm a man turned to a female, I can't be in female sports, like he he doesn't he like he believes he believes that like that shouldn't be happening of course but as a transgender that's kind of shocking but the thing is if if Caitlyn thinks that he uh could uh, actually pull this off and thinks that you know more about politics I'm, I'm being honest with you bro there are people that don't have a degree don't have a uh, freaking any like source of in politics don't have a Form of office and they are smarter than other people. It, 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 I'm being honest. Look, look at Jay Z. He's worth billions of dollars. Look at, look at all these famous rappers. They're worth billions of dollars, or millions of dollars. Diddy, he's worth almost a billion dollars. Fifty Cent, he making a lot of money. These people didn't even go to college. They actually putting their work in, and they didn't even go to college. You can make your money. You can make your money some type of way. In different ways. If if he thinks that he could actually pull this off and be the ne next governor of California, pass off to him. I'm a conservative. I'm a Republican. I'm a black conservative. You know. So if he thinks that he can pull this off and he has like actually good ideas and just stuff I agree with, go ahead, knock yourself out. All right. That's the end of uh the legend talk, man. I appreciate you guys for everything. You know. It's a long lesson talk. I really don't like my lesson talks being that long, but it's whatever. Like and subscribe. Tell your friends about this channel, man. I appreciate you guys. Peace. I would really like if you guys would follow me on Instagram. I gladly would appreciate it. Yeah. Hey, hey, listen to me. Listen to me. Aaron Rodgers is never, ever, 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 ever coming back.